Hey guys, this is the Direwolf, and tonight I'm going to teach you about how to use cheat engines to increase your experience, your XP, and your uh, credits, your money on the game called Wreckfest. Uh, I use this because the, the game is local file, so if you remove the game from Steam, you lose your save and you lose everything you work towards, and it's a huge pain. Uh, but luckily, it's a local file, so you can use something here called cheat engines with uh, cheat engine which I'm going to teach you how to use for this game at least in order to uh, just basically hack it to give yourself the more money the more uh, experience so you can unlock all the stuff you may have had or if you're new to the game hey no shame here if you want to just you don't want to grind unlock stuff you don't have to with this one luckily uh, so let's just get right to it you just go ahead and hit that uh, button here that brings up your process list window uh, you got to add the process that is Wreckfest the game. So you need Wreckfest running before you run Cheat Engine. And I'll post a link in the description to uh, download Cheat Engine. Open up that process. And what do we got here? So we need to search for the value that we want to change. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to enter in, first of all, the number of credits that I have. Uh, your number is obviously going to be smaller than this. I've already done mine. 9987955. And let's do a first scan. And now for me, this only brought up six values. Uh, since I've already done this, I know that if I change all of these, should be fine. So we're going to go do that. We're going to change it back to 100 million because I never want to be broke. I mean, I'm not, I'm not trying to be Bill Gates or anything, but whatever. So you see, I don't have it yet. But if I go to my garage, boom, there it is. I got it. That easy. Um, so now your level, your experience, this can be a little bit more difficult. So we're going to change this value to the 2076185. That is my experience value. And it is running, I think. No, it wasn't. Okay, so now you see that I have a whole bunch of these. Um, it's my understanding, I haven't tried it, that I don't want to just change all of these for some reason. Um, might cause a crash or issues. I don't know. I'm going off of what other people have said. Uh, there was another video. It wasn't super clear on anything, but there's an easy way to narrow that down. So I'm going to go ahead and create a custom event. Let's, uh, we'll use my rammer event option, a last man standing. Let's knock this down to just a few. Actually, I'm gonna make it 10. Let's have some fun while we're at it. Make it lawnmowers. The rest of it doesn't really matter. Start that event off. What we're doing here is we're just trying to change our XP and then we scan again, and it'll compare what it had the first time. So a last man standing match, match against lawnmowers, very easy. All you got to do is knock all of these people off their lawnmowers. Doesn't get much simpler than that, right? So, hey, it's a dude straight ahead of me. That'll be an easy kill to start things off. Wreck them! <laughs> that stuff just doesn't get old. Um, there's another one. Dead. Got three in a row here. Kill him. It's a lucky mower. Dead. Dead. <laughs> dead. Nope. Nope. Ah, now he's dead. Dead. <laughs> that guy just died on his own. Uh, opponents, two left. Where are they at? Are they chasing me? There he is. There's another one. Frick. I'm going to get a run at this. Oh my god, they're just chasing. Oh, there's the other one. I didn't see him until it's too late. Alright. Either way, have some fun just murdering people out for a run on there. I can hear him. There he is. That's one dead, I think. No, he survived. What a lucky jerk. I don't think he's surviving that one. No, he did not. Alright, one left. Where are you at, punk? He's, ah, there he's dead. All right. And that's enough to just get a little bit of XP. Uh, really, it doesn't matter how much we get. 560 credits and a little bit of extra XP. Boom. And I just chose 2 million randomly when I did this before. But uh, you can see that a bunch of these are red. So um, what we're going to do is we're going to now search for 2080223. And we're going to hit the next scan button. And there's only two now. And I did get a crash the first time I did this, but when I relaunched the game, it's been absolutely fine since. So I wouldn't worry too much about that. But let's just uh, uh, let's make it 
two oh nine zero 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 zero. So two million ninety thousand. Okay. That is changed. Now I don't remember what I have to do. There, boom. You can see it changed. That is it. It's that simple. Cheat engine. Check for the link in the comments or the description. Um, I'll pin a comment too, just to make it easier to find. That simple. Uh, yeah. Hit that like and subscribe if you found this useful. Uh, if you want to race with us, hit us up on Twitch. Uh, we stream every time we have a community server on the Discord. That link will be below. We'll see you guys uh, in the races, hopefully, with uh, fully decked out cars because of this little hack. Have a good one. Oh, right.